Hello and welcome to this video on how to set up a drawing that can be used for a client's presentation. So in this case I want to set up a floor plan, but first I want to make a duplicate of the floor plan. And I want to duplicate it with the detailing. And then I'll just rename it. So just call it ground floor and presentation and then click OK. And if this um, floor plan is for a client's presentation, then normally the client would not be interested in seeing the grid lines and the brick meshes and so on. So we'll just start by turning off the dimensions and do the same with the grid lines. And then what the client is interested in is, for example, the amount of square meters in the different rooms and also it could be uh, the name of the room. Um, but to illustrate this better, we can also make a color scheme. So, for example, the bathrooms will have one color, the bedroom will have another color, kitchen a third color and so on. Um, to create the color scheme, we need to go to the architectural menu and then uh, click on room and area. And here we can select the color schemes. And first we want to um, select the category and we want, the, want to di divide the color scheme by room. And then we will be able to uh, give it a name uh, or rename the, the part right here. Uh, just click on the name and then uh, on the rename it could be client's presentation or just room presentation and then click OK and then by default uh, Revit will set up some different colors but uh, you will be able to change the colors if you click on this part right here and then change to the color that you uh, that you would like for, for example if you want to have a red color just select it here and then you can um, make it more bright or you can make it less bright, bright if you click on the arrow right here. We'll just cancel this one and accept the colors that has been set up. So we'll just click apply and then OK. And then in the beginning we cannot see anything in, in the plan. But if we go to the property menu and under color scheme we will have to select. And uh, again we have to set the category to rooms. And in here we have to select um, the scheme that we just created uh, called Room Presentation. Click Apply and OK. And now we can see that the different rooms have, um, have its own color. So we have the bathroom with one color, bedroom with another and so on. If we for example uh, decide to turn off um, the text right here um, with the description, the room description and the square meters, if you just click on it and then right click, hide in view and category, um, then we also need some information um, of what the different colors mean. Um, so if we go um, to annotate and then uh, on the color fill, then we have to select the color fill legend and then we can just uh, place it somewhere next to the to the plan drawing and you can modify this um, if you click on it and then just drag the arrow and uh, you can get it in one line for example and just move it if you want it in the bottom um, so it's up to you to set up the layout uh, but this is just a principle on how you can um, create a color scheme